I've got nothing to say to you. You deserve better than... than this. Not just me, Graham. Eliza. What the hell were you thinking? It's... it's complicated. Was it? What? Me and you were just a stopgap until that half-faced tramp got out. No. Look, this is why I was so resistant about it. Oh. Then I wore you down, so it was my fault. I had no idea what would happen when Kim came home. Oh, until you ended up in bed together and it all made sense. I know. I'm weak. I'm pathetic. No. No. You're sick. You must have known that Kim was due out today. I honestly had no idea until she rang me this morning. Which makes it even worse. Because you had the choice to say no. Were you ever going to come with us? Of course. You might not believe this, but, um... You mean a great deal to me. I really wanted it, the whole thing. It's just... Um... You wanted Kim more. And that's what I tell Eliza, is it? All that time we were waiting... Graham ditched us because he got a better offer. I didn't want you getting messed up in this. Yeah, well, it didn't stop you when you were a messed up drunk. I'm a big girl. I can handle this. I'm sorry. You had to start something really good. And you screwed it up. I oh, know. Yeah. Well, you don't get a second chance. So good luck. Kim is going to destroy you. Now, get out. <laughs> oh, I had hoped you were coming back up for an encore. Apologies. That pull off. Well, this, uh, wasn't quite how it was meant to pan out, but I suppose at least she knows now. Hmm? About us. Us? Yes. The us that just had sex. Twice. Uh, look, we are on the same page here. You didn't seriously end it with Megan on my account. Bit late. She did pretty much cash us in bed together. And you weren't exactly discreet. Hey, you getting caught with your pants down is hardly my fault. <laughs> like this was ever some grand reunion. We had fun. No ties, no questions. Come on, Graham. It's what we do remember. I definitely like cats more than dogs because you don't have to walk cats. Hey, she wolfed down all the lunch. Great. So, um, um, Graham has got a problem with his car, so he can't take us. Well, no, he's not had a crash or anything, has he? Sadly not. Right, let's get Eco on, because me and you have got Beatrix Potter World to go to. What a completely useless, low-down yeah. piece of... Well, well, we'll go for the rest of the day, and we'll come back tomorrow, OK? Be better anyway, won't it, with just you and Mummy? I certainly don't need him. Right, come on, sweetheart, let's go. 